Yo, what's popping? You're rolling with Ricketts on the Leon Knight Network. My boy Leon Knight hit me up to ask me, what do I think of England's World Cup? Well, let's cut to the chase. I was extremely disappointed. I've never actually sat there and supported the nation, ever. Do you know what I mean? I've played for England up to 20, under 21 level, but I've never supported them when they've, not been, when, when they've been playing these major championships since I was a young boy because I've never been impressed by the way that they play football. Uh, I support Manchester United, so there's always been a lot of Man United players within the team, but I'm not biased like that. I want to see good football being played. I don't just support you just because I'm born there. Do you know what I mean? I'm an actual true lover of football and, and the beautiful game. So this was the first time that I've actually, actually ever supported the country. And it was more so to the fact that we had some great young players. No, sorry, I went a bit too far there. Some really good young players that I really believe in, still do. And I'm looking forward to them in the future, having a better, better showing in the World Cup. But I just don't think that the, the English style of coaching, the, 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 the English... You know, the way they, they play football and the way they, they, they've been taught to play football. I don't think it benefits the players that we've given a chance, or should I say, Roy gave a chance at this World Cup. So I, I do think they're in, still in need of a root canal job in terms of the English coaching. I think they should look to hire in people like Glenn Hoddle, Chris Waddle, Brendan Rogers, Arsene Wenger, um, employing these people as consultants rather than coaches because I think if there was employed as coaches they'll be judged they'll be judged on the results and I think when you're looking for growth and the growth that I think we need um, as a nation football wise I think we need time and you can't be judging the coach of of results so maybe it's a, a, a younger coach who, who's willing to you could say be like an understudy to these more experienced guys and we got to be patient as a nation. But yeah, I was extremely disappointed. Disgrace. So, I mean, couldn't even win a game. Uh, there was a few bright sparks. I'm not going to mention anyone because over and behind, we was, we was terrible. So, root canal job. I'm not, I can't go into it too much because I can't waste all my energy in there because I've been, they've been doing this for years now. I've been doing this for years. The same old thing. Why can't England qualify? So, I mean, I don't know why even people take England as serious as we do. It's just because of the Premier League is the biggest league in the world. But people forget, and it's only the biggest league because we have some top, top foreigners in the league. Because if you take away all the foreigners, what do you have? The English national team. There it goes. Rolling over kids.